Sports. Your CNOS Health Watch on Siouxland News. As we work our way into winter, slips and falls increase the chance of injury. And when surgery is needed, arthroscopic surgery can cut down on the recovery time. Siouxland News reporter Katie Link has more. Arthroscopy is a process that reduces the size of the incision for many surgeries. Dr. Ray Sherman is one of four fellowship trained orthopedic surgeons that uses this technique at CNOS. Doing it through the telescope decreases pain and uh, if you have less pain they're more likely to be able to cooperate with physical therapy. Uh, if you make a big cut it's, you have to wait for this muscle to heal um, and the recovery is longer. Arthroscopy can mean a much quicker recovery if it's an option, but sometimes it may be too late. If we wait for six months to a year or longer, those chronic large tears become scarred down and stuck, and so it makes surgery much more difficult. For example, every year Dr. Sherman and his colleagues perform over 200 arthroscopic surgeries on rotator cuffs. Doctors pass the tools through three small holes and stitch the torn muscles into place. Make this bone bleed. So you take off a little bit about it because that's where the blood supply comes from. The healing occurs when we can get this to stick down to there. Then a series of anchors are screwed into the bone to hold the thread used to stitch down the torn muscle. At six weeks, the rotator cuff is glued to the bone. It takes three months to grow the rotator cuff to the bone. For Siouxland News, I'm Katie Link.